I really do miss Drive Club. And the driver's hand went 900 degrees. I forgot about that. Look at this. Look at this. What other game does that? What's going on, everybody? Welcome back today, guys, to the channel. Tuesday morning. Hopefully, you guys did have a good weekend. Uh, we're back here with some fresh content, man. We have Drive Club hitting the channel. I'm very excited about this game. If you guys don't know, unfortunately, uh, it has been taken offline some time ago. All right, so if you go into Drive Club, uh, there's no online. Uh, there's no more challenges. It's just the career mode, and that is it. But we do have the bikes as well. Uh, I'm not going to be taking a look at those today. I just want to drive some cars today. And this was a game uh, that really stood out from a lot of the wheel-based games just because of how good it felt on the wheel how fun it was as well too so we're gonna hit back into the tour and uh, we still have a lot to do so if you guys would like to see this done as you know an actual let's play I mean let me know down in the comment section also too right if you guys do want to keep seeing drive club you already know what to do babe don't forget to slap that like button GTR oh I haven't driven the GTR in a long time all right Oh, it's a drift event, man. This is perfect. Okay. All right, little Thrustmaster TGT action. T3PA pro pedals underneath, inverted. Then we have our TH8A shifter uh, right on the right-hand side here. So this should be fun. We have our wheel stand pro holding this whole rig up. Oh, man. This game looks so good. Everything about this game, I love Drive Club. I really did. And, you know, I was really hoping it was going to continue on into the new year. And, you know, Drive Club 2 was going to come out. All right, level 29 here. I don't know what paint I want to go with. I'm thinking maybe... The white looks kind of nice, to be honest. GTR, man. Jeez. We're Black Panther right now. <laughs> Alright, let's go red. I don't know why, but I like red. We even got the guy going in to sit down. This game was so good, man. Damn. Really does hit me in the feels, though. I miss this game. I really do. I didn't really get enough of a chance to play it online, I felt like, too. I kind of, you know, missed that opportunity. Right, it sucked better, right? I mean, but we did get a lot of top 10 drifts, and I kind of played the game through you guys, right? You know, when I would get the clips coming in, uh, you know, I'd like to watch them for the drive club purposes, and right, they're always fun to look at. There you go. In the rain. Garbage can. Oh my god, we missed the garbage can. Okay. Thought for sure I was going to touch that. A lot of these are just. Huge entry thing. Toss it. I love the rain though. Oh, so I don't know what it is, but I love this third person on this game. I always have. Oh shit. Can you grip up? Thank you. I'm sliding all around two of the floor again. Go, go look at the angle, man. This thing chugging. That's gotta be first place run, no? Target was 6,500, we got 8,000, man. We just go, and we're gonna also unlock cars as we do. I forgot how this game had its progression system. And to be honest with you, I loved it. I loved everything about this game. You, know, you had to work for each car in the game. Um, I'm pretty, right? I'm pretty sure that's how it went. All right, let's check out the AMG category here. Oh, yeah, okay, this is this is a nice change over here. Finished third in the race, uh, best B corner face off 14. Okay, yeah, let's do this here. This looks fun. We're a handful of cars, of course, we gotta go with the AMG GTS. Uh, I've actually driven one of these in real life and they are fun, man. I'm talking about a lot of fun. We have the SL65 45th Anniversary Edition. All right, a lot of these cars, really cool to see them in the game. Just, you know, really refreshing. And the detail around them, right, they look great. And that's why I was so surprised when I heard that this game was going under, right? I could not believe it. I really couldn't. You know, it was a tough pill to swallow, especially after the VR game came out. Thankfully, we still have all those, right? So we can play those and look back on them, but this was probably one of the better racing games in the last decade to come and go, probably in the fastest that we've ever seen it, right? I mean, sad to see, man, but hopefully, I don't know if you guys have any information about where these guys went to, um, you know, what happened to the actual development team behind here. I think somebody picked them up, and I think they're working on a current game, but I can't think of the game that they're working on, but this is gonna be a fun race. But I feel like Drive Club was onto something, right? All they really needed to do we just come out with another game, maybe open world, you know, that utilize these physics and, you know, this engine that they're using. And they could have had a really good game on their hands. And, right, I mean, that's the thing. It just sucks to see, uh, you know, the kind of the game go under before it really had a chance uh, to do something big with it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Just getting a little loose behind you. 
cut hard. No, I forgot we had penalties! Come on. That's not fair. <laughs> I mean, it is, but it's not for me, though. So I rip it down here. I'm not too mad about it getting sideways. Like I said, coming back to this game to just relive it. Oh my god, yeah, I'm reliving the anger about it. I forgot. I'm just kidding, I'm not. I'm not getting angry, I'm having fun. I do wish I had more force feedback. Like, where's all the force feedback on? I feel like the vibration was a big factor in how it felt. So let's just go back to this here. And we're gonna just pray that vibration isn't as bad when you're racing. But I feel like vibration would give you a good sense of the road. And that's kind of what I'm missing right now. Oh shit. No, I'm going off. Oh, we had dynamic weather in this game, man. It was so good. Whether it would hit us as we're driving, man, I really do miss Drive Club. And the driver's hand went 900 degrees. I forgot about that. Look at this. Look at this. What other game does that? No other game, man. Oh. Makes me so mad that this game is done. Not a dent, right? Just in general, it just makes me upset. Oh, shit. We're good. I'm still sliding on my chair. Coming over this crest. It's really quiet in the cabin, to be honest. Which it is though, usually when you are driving the same. You would think it has actually a lot more kind of get up inside of it, but I mean, if you had windows down, it should. But it's raining, man. And I feel like if Need for Speed adopted the physics engine of Drive Club and utilized it for the next Need for Speed game, I think there would be something big behind it. I really do. But I don't think they're gonna get off the rail system, right? That's the problem that they have. It's the goddamn rails in the game, man. It's okay, I can come back to games like Drive Club and have some fun on it, man. Right? We're gonna clutch kick that out. Ah, it doesn't want to go. Thank you. Car's looking a little shitty, right? I mean, that's okay. Just a rental. Come back. Oh, no, no. I'm in last place anyways, man. Nobody's gonna notice if I leave this race, okay? So we're gonna hop out of here. I want to check out another car here. I see a GTR. I want to use a GTR. Oh, there it is. Okay. V6 twin turbo, 3.8, 542 brake horsepower. Bentley V12 twin turbo, 616, uh, but does weigh a shit ton. Well, it's actually not even that much more than the GTR, to be honest with you. Hop on in, sir, man. I've actually had the opportunity to drive this car as well. And uh, they're, they're so much faster than you think. You get in there and you're like, oh, okay, you're right. It's cool. And then you start driving and it's like, wow, you're going to get in trouble. Okay. Coming back, man. Drive Club. Final thoughts, I think, on this game. Honestly, I need to come back to this game a lot more. If you guys do want to keep seeing it, like I said, slap that like button. If there is any car recommendation that you would like me to check out, leave it down below in the comment section. I guess we're on the stick shift once more. Nice little acceleration. Has gotten bumped right off the track. We're going to try to keep our car clean. I can. Oh, 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 excuse me. Make way. A big Betty coming through, right? This is a big curl. Big wheelbase. We're going side by side with another one. He's rubbing that bumper. Let's see if I can get this out a little bit. Oh, we just think the wall on that. That was actually really cool. Come on. Why? Why would you do that? Sir, I'm clearly hitting the corner hard right there. Like, that was a nice little run. Damn, AIs don't understand. Come on. I just don't know really where I'm going, so when we're driving through this, I'm constantly looking at the map just to make sure I'm not going to end up coming. Oh, yeah. Hey, we have our guy in there. I forgot we actually have a customizable character that we can run. Game is... Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is a lot more realistic game and demanding game than you would expect it to be. It really would. But I do wish I had a little bit more force feedback. I don't know why it's kind of not feeling as hard as I would expect it to. Bumping right out the way. Same corner got me again. Right, I mean, remember, 900 degrees. We got a lot of wheel movement. 
And I feel like if this game was meant for almost, what, 720, I feel like a lot of people said back in the day, I think. Oh, yeah! Now we're having some fun with it! Keep it going! Oh, yes! This makes me want to play this game so much more. Super responsive. Just tap that hamburger a couple times. You're gonna keep it going. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we're good. We're good. We're just taking the old sideline. Got confetti hitting me in the face right there. Thankfully, my windows are up. You got that sun just right over there. Can barely see a damn thing when it's there. Need some sunglasses. Oh, so. All right, a little onboard action here. Again, I love, I love the attention to detail on this game. I just heard it kick in third gear. That was really cool. Go, go. Yeah, I definitely need to be back on this game. Some more damn replays. What's with his fingers there? You see that? Oh, sh right, If I had paddles, this would be so much easier, though. I'm going to have to figure that out next time. Maybe I'll just disconnect the shifter. I didn't even really think of that. I mean, this guy's trying to cut in as I'm sliding. Go, go. Just clutch kick second gear a bit. This is last lap, by the way, so we are going to need to pass a couple people here. Hopefully, we get first. I wonder if I can wall ride. I'm going to try it. Oh, yeah, kind of. Go, go. Oh, my God. We got those damn penalties on, I think. Go. We got nighttime now hitting us? How long have we been out here for? 24 hour race, man, it feels like. It's cool though, right? I mean, that was the progression of this game. Go. Trash run. Trash. Go. Go. I may have would have had a chance to catch up to get second place, but not now though. I mean, I may right here. Oh, I lost it. That's it, man. That's it for me right there. Not bad. What? Fourth place? With a lot of drifting or a heavy drifting session out there. But it was fun, though. And that's the thing, right? You gotta enjoy this game to play it. And the physics really do make it enjoyable. Go ahead and have a quick look at the replay. I mean, just look, look at the, the raindrops on the wheels, man. Like, it's ridiculous, the detail. I'm gonna go ahead and hide everything up here love these cameras. I miss the cameras on this game. The replay angles. I mean, this is prime commentary footage right here. I could just record a bunch of these, talk over it if I really wanted to, right? But the replay angles on this game are really impressive, and they did a great job overall. I mean, like I said, I gave Drive Club when it first came out. I think I gave it a high score, you know, 9 if not 10 after I really understood the game. But it was more of a simulation game, and you know, at the time, I don't think a lot of people were expecting it to be as simulation as it was in terms of the real physics and you know the snapback of the car sometimes but it was a hard but fun game i definitely enjoyed it i really enjoyed coming back to it for today and hopefully like i said if you guys want to see this and this does get a little bit of attention we'll definitely come back and do another episode on drive club but right here getting boxed in on the lab man lost a lot of time out here obviously me getting sideways the whole time didn't help either right but the fun factor through the roof man i had a blast Thrustmasters, TGT, all their products will be found down below, as well as Wheelstand Pro. Uh, huge thank you to you guys for coming around, and if you guys do want to see more, don't forget to subscribe with post notifications, turn them on. You guys can always follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, all of which are found down below. I'm out.